We will explain how to have a regular hardness and how eating bananas contributes to it. While it is true that having regular hardness helps to maintain the mechanisms and the health of manhood, the rigidity of it is not always satisfactory. So, how to have a strong hardness, in other words, how to get a hard on and avoid a soft on. In the United States, impotence affects nearly 30 million men. And yet, there are simple gestures that can improve getting hard. Discover the natural or medicated methods to having a strong hardness and enlarge your manhood. Lifestyle, diet, psychological factors, sport. Mr. X evaluates the situation, whatever the size of your manhood. How to get a strong hardness. So, how do you get a better hardness? The first fundamental aspect, diet. What diet should you choose to have a strong hardness? Favor a balanced diet. Fruit and vegetables, for example, are rich in vitamins and nitric oxide. They have a beneficial effect on blood circulation, blood vessels, and arteries. A 2004 study showed the importance of changing one's diet for better bed performances, and in particular, a better hardness. 30% of obese men improved theirs by changing their diet alone. Eat food products known to be aphrodisiacs, such as ginger, maca, or ginseng. Garlic, too, is an excellent vasodilator and promotes blood circulation. Keep in mind that during intercourse or stimulation, blood is continuously flowing in and out of manhood to properly oxygenate itself, so vascular health is a paramount for it. There are many natural aphrodisiacs. They will not have a miracle effect, but will help boost your libido. In fact, intimacy dysfunction often comes from a lack of libido or excitement. So, it may be worthwhile to choose your food supplements carefully. Consult a therapist for personalized advice on well-being. Avoid tobacco and drink alcohol in moderation. Smoking slows down the flow of blood to your manhood by reducing blood flow and generally harms your cardiovascular health. In short, reduce your intake of animal fats, sugar, and eat a diet rich in antioxidants. Doing sport increases the chances of having a good hardness. Regular sport helps to maintain physical and mental capacities. Reduction of stress, improvement of cardiovascular capacities, release of endorphins, creation of testosterone, etc. The benefits of sport are numerous for the love life. In fact, therapists know specific techniques and training to boost your libido. Don't hesitate to talk to a therapist to set up a roadmap and get back into shape physically and intimately. Being overweight is sometimes the cause of some rigidity dysfunction. However, don't exceed one hour of sport per day. Exercise your pelvic muscles, which are directly related to the quality of your hardness and release. Kegel exercises, for example, are an effective way to work these muscles. They will strengthen the muscles in the intimate area. Diet and fitness, therefore, promote pleasure fulfillment. Rigidity dysfunction can have various causes, but most of them are psychological. Factors such as stress or anxiety can be reduced by exercising or by working on oneself. For example, meditation. A lowered libido is sometimes also the result of a complicated relationship or exhaustion. It is important to maintain your relationship and avoid routine. Sleep, psychological factors, and strong hardness. A healthy lifestyle contributes to mental and physical hygiene. A balanced diet and sport promote a good relationship with the body and a healthy mind. A good night's sleep also helps to regulate a number of hormonal secretions necessary for intimacy. Before considering one's love life in a peaceful manner, one must live in a peaceful and healthy manner. Reduce the stress in one's life or all the psychological manifestations that can stand in the way of intimacy. Porn abuse, for example, can damage your love life in many ways. It is not so much excessive self-stimulation, per se, that can ultimately interfere with hardness, but rather the mindset that accompanies it. If self-stimulation is used as a drug to solve personal difficulties, stress, or anxiety, then this same state, stress, may cause rigidity problems. The body and mind are closely linked, 
and nurturing both is the key to feeling good about yourself. As a couple or single, maintain your desire for better hardness. To have a strong hardness, you must already be aroused. Nurturing your desire also means changing your daily routine. Something that becomes too regular often loses interest. There is something exciting about the unknown. As a couple, it is important to innovate, whether in bed or in life. Change your habits to maintain your desire for your partner. Don't be predictable. A therapist can help you regain your desire and improve your hardness during a consultation. Routine is sometimes the enemy of your libido. There are plenty of toys, games, or ways to change your love life if you find it is becoming too monotonous. And bananas? There are many reasons to eat bananas every day. Rich in potassium, bananas are a superfood. It reduces bloating, fights cancer. It is also a remedy for hangovers. It also improves blood circulation and helps you have an excellent regular hardness. It is also possible that your hardness problem is due to erectile dysfunction. If you want to be sure, fill in the questionnaire in the description and you will have the answer in less than five minutes. How to keep your hardness. There are several methods, medication or mechanical treatments. Indeed, drugs such as Viagra, Sildenafil, Cialis, Tadalafil, Levitra can be used in low doses even when a man does not have rigidity dysfunction as such, but would still like to improve his hardness. Note, however, that these drugs cannot be purchased without a prescription from a doctor. Specifically, it is not possible to buy generic Viagra without a prescription online, or even to buy Cialis or Tadalafil without a prescription. Another possible drug treatment is an intracavernosal injection, Caverject, Edex, to mechanically get hard. In 95% of cases, a solution to rigidity dysfunction is found, with penile prothesis as a last resort. In fact, the quality of the hardness is a highly variable and subjective to criterion. Unless there are contrained indications, it is quite possible to consider treatment simply to improve love life. In parallel, if the therapist considers it necessary, psychological work can be carried out. The advantages are bilateral. The medication allows for a better hardness and makes the psychological work more interesting. Six out of 10 men have experienced rigidity dysfunction. According to survey, 61% of men have experienced rigidity dysfunction during lovemaking. This proportion has even increased in recent years. Yes, many men wonder how to last longer in bed. Although rigidity dysfunction becomes more frequent with age, it is also possible to have this dysfunction at the age of 40, for example. In this case, it is mainly psychological causes or a poor lifestyle that are responsible. Among men who have had an irrigity dysfunction in the last 12 months, 20% of them admit to having experienced difficulties related to the rigidity of their hardness. But sometimes a rigidity problem can be linked to another disorder, such as premature release. In fact, being focused on early release can disrupt arousal and therefore the hardness, or one may simply be trying to escape intercourse. The Opinion of the Therapist How to Improve and Maintain Getting Hard How to Get a Big Hard On In general, to have a good one, you have to remove everything that can deteriorate it. The first piece of advice is therefore to avoid anything that can slow down the rigidity process. That is to say, it is already necessary to have a good quality of sleep, a low-fat diet, not to consume tobacco, alcohol, toxic substances, drugs, etc. Secondly, it is important to rest well mentally and physically. Sleep regulates a number of hormones. What to do if you have a rigidity dysfunction? If, despite all the tips mentioned above, you continue to experience frequent intimacy breakdowns, you probably have a real rigidity dysfunction. Rigidity dysfunction affects many men for a variety of reasons. It is characterized by a difficulty in obtaining and maintaining getting hard at each intercourse or almost for at least three months. But how do you get a strong hard on? In this case, a consultation with a therapist is necessary. 
he or she will be able to determine the cause of your problem and thus suggest the most suitable solution for regaining a lasting hardness. You should know that there are medical treatments to treat this dysfunction. Viagra, Cialis, or Levitra. Their active ingredients such as Tadalafil or Sildenafil act on the bloodstream to promote a hardness. However, to obtain rigidity dysfunction medication, a medical prescription is required. A consultation with a therapist is necessary in order to prevent the disorder from taking hold. The psychological consequences can be significant. Shame, embarrassment, and guilt. Men can have a very difficult time dealing with this situation. In this respect, we recommend that you talk to professionals so that you don't get trapped in a vicious circle that would be detrimental to you. Strong hard on. What you need to remember. If rigidity dysfunction persists, there may be psychological causes age, overweight, chronic diseases, cholesterol, diabetes, multiple sclerosis, high blood pressure, a hormonal problem, a damage of certain nerves, certain medicines and treatments, example antidepressants, or neurological disorders can affect the erection. Medical events can also affect the system itself, directly or indirectly. For example, treatment for prostate cancer is often determined by the patient's love life. Surgery to remove the prostate gland, prostectomy, can damage the rigidity system and cause a dysfunction, as well as psychological factors. Sometimes the cause of a rigidity dysfunction is organic, physical. Therefore, a therapist or urologist will be able to identify whether the causes of these problems are medical and or psychological.